Hello, sports fans and college football fans. This time it's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. Today I'm doing a little uh, quick video previewing the 122nd Army-Navy game. The Army-Navy game will be played on Saturday, December 11th in MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford, New Jersey between the Navy Midshipmen and the Army Black Knights. So, um, Army comes into this, uh, into this game with a record of 8-3. and three. Navy Midshipmen are 3-8. and eight. And yes, I have an Enterprise hat on, but no, I was never, I did not serve on the Enterprise, but I was in the Navy. And so, obviously... I'm going to be rooting for Navy in this game. But anyway, I digress. The Army Midshipmen come in, um, or the Navy the Navy Midshipmen come in 3 and 8. Return the beer keg. Cancel the dancing girl. And Army is 8 and 3, the opposite record. So, on the record, on the face of the record, it looks like uh, Army is going to have the upper hand in this game. And, uh, and potentially be the favorite to win the game. Although, if you know the history of the Army and Navy game, throw the records out the window. Um, because that doesn't mean nothing. So in the last 10 years, Navy uh, leads the series with a record of 6-4. and four. However, over the last five years, Army is 4-1. and one. Um, And in the last 10 years, two of, uh, or uh, one of the wins for each team were when they were ranked. Navy won the game the year that they were ranked and uh, in the top 25, and um, Army won the uh, game the year that they were ranked in the top 25. I'm not sure that's going to happen this year. I don't think, well, definitely Navy is not ranked, and I don't think Army is either. Um, but, um, so anyway, uh, one of the major themes of this year's game is going to be remembering 9-11 and the military's response to 9-11. So, uh, I, I think they always do some kind of a some kind of a, a patriotic theme for the uh, game. Uh, and kickoff will be at 3 p.m. on Saturday, December 11th. So uh, that's, uh, yeah, that's my, let's see. Oh, and the Lifetime Series record, Navy leads 61, 53, and 7. There were seven ties in the game. Uh, but uh, they were that was fueled mainly by a run of 14 straight years. I think it was like 14 straight years that Navy won recently. Um, but uh, yeah, as of late, Navy hasn't quite been as good as Army. They've got a better football team. But a better football team does not guarantee that you're going to win the Army-Navy game. So... Uh, all I got to say about that is, go Navy, beat Army.